Hi you guys, thanks again for coming by and clicking that button to view another video that I have. As you can see by the title, this is going to be a empties video. And surprisingly, I have a lot of empties. Like, I'm really shocked at all the empties that I have this month. And I'm thinking to myself, how did I get all these empties? But then again, I think I didn't do one last month. But it's still a lot of doggone empties. So, but anywho, I want to quit rambling. And try to get on into this because I really don't know if I was thinking the last empties I did to where let me use up a lot of stuff so I can have another empties video to show you guys. That's just how shocked I am about all these empties. And also, let's get on to digging into my trash basically, okay? <clears throat> so, the first thing I want to show you guys. Here is the Brazilian Pineapple and Punch by Bath and Body Works Deep Cleaning Hand Soap. You guys, I love this soap. I tell you guys a million of times, I do love the deep cleaning, the ones that have the beads in it. It lasts longer in my house, and for one, I feel like it cleans my, our hands, my family's hands, my hands and my family's hands the most. The most. Um, I do not care for the foam by uh, Bath and Body Works. Smells really good. It's kind of smell like a, a line later or a Starburst. More, more yeah, Starburst. I will say. Um, type of scent. I did love this one. Um, I will repurchase this again. Nevertheless to say I, I just love Bath and Body Works hand soap. So yes, I will repurchase. So being that I have that one, I have another one here. It's by Bourbon Street Buttercream. Looks like that. This one was okay. Um, the scent, it smelled kind of clean but uh, fruity at the same time. Uh, I did enjoy it. I really don't have no bad things to say about Bath and Body Works hand soap, especially the deep, clean, deep cleaning ones. Um, I really do enjoy them. Uh, my family enjoy them. So when they're out, I always try to get more when they have a sale. So yes, I will repurchase this again. Maybe not this particular uh, scent. It was okay, but uh, I'll repurchase it again. Next thing, sticking with Bath and Body Works, I want to say. I used up a pocket back white the um, hand sanitizer, and this one is in the white peach. Um, I just showed you guys this in a previous haul. I have, yes, I used, well, I got a little drop here. Let me use it. I probably need to use it now that I'm about to be going through these germs. I'm going to hold on to this to the end of the video, but needless to say, I did love. The smell is so pleasant, like. I love it and it lingers it lingers for a while and I like that you know I love those types of smell so I did like that the next thing I have here is the renew and refresh candle by the white barn one of my favorites I do love the renew and refresh scent I love them I do love the white barn line and now that I notice I don't know if you guys noticed but my um, Bath and Body Works now actually have Bath and Body Works and then you go on to the other side they actually have like the white barn collection It's look all like a barn inside of a barn it's really really nice maybe one of these days I can take you guys in there and show you what it looks like it's really nice I'm glad that they did it so I don't know if um, Bath and Body Works is trying to step up their game or what it is that they're doing but I do like it must say I do but will I repurchase their candles again absolutely um if you guys seen a previous video you just seen that I did a haul on some candles so uh yes I will repurchase Bath and Body Works candles next thing I'm going to uh, put out here is this Dove pampering um purely pampering nourish body wash Yes, love this. Oh, uh, there we go. It's going to get dark. I don't know why, but the lighting. But anyway, I love the Dove body wash. Um, this one has the 10 times moisture. Smells so good. Like when I get out my shower, is throughout my whole shower, in my bedroom, everything. I love um, this smell. So that's it will I repurchase it yes absolutely I love Dove body wash I used to do a lot of the Bath and Body Works but I'm finding myself to where I don't like it I just don't I don't know I know a lot of women here do it and I did that once too but I'm loving Dove so being with that said I used up another one and this one here is actually my favorite scent out of all of them with the deep moisture and that looks like this one the deep moisture line woohoo this smells good 
I love this scent. And it's the 10 times moisture as well. So the deep moisture one. And which one is this one? This was the purely pampering, but this is my favorite. Uh, me and my daughters, actually, I know my oldest daughter, she loved this one too. So yes, favorite. Let's keep on digging in my trash. Next thing I used up is the Batiste Dry Shampoo. When I had my hair straightening, straighten, this is what I used to stretch it. And it stretched where I did not wash my hair for three weeks. Yes, three weeks. And I could have went four weeks, really. But um, I just wanted to get to where I wanted to wash my hair. And so now it's like in a ponytail right now. It's not straightened, but I will be straightening it here in a couple of days. So, yes, I will be repurchasing this. I love this. Um, a great invention out there. Uh, absolutely. Whoever came up with this is absolute genius. Love this dry shampoo. Will I repurchase this particular classic, no, clean and classic, the original one? No. Um, being that it gives a white canvas on my hair, it did get it kind of pretty clean. The grease, it takes out, it draws out the um, oiliness, not the grease, the oily in my hair but I love the um, brunette one so and I'm using that now and actually I put it on this type of hair so when I don't feel like washing my hair and my hair stinks a little bit I do spray that in there and it works great when your hair is um, you know like in its natural state to where it's not for my African American women you guys will understand to where oh wow she understands too <laughs> but for uh Women of color, uh, you guys know what I mean by when I say when it's in the natural state and not straightened. So, yes. Okay, you guys, I am back. Like I said, I had to tend to the little one. So now she's all straight with her blueberries. So hopefully that keep her occupied throughout the rest of this video. We'll see. Okay, so the next thing I have here is my whipped cream by Curls. Um, love this stuff. It moisturizes your hair really, really good. It does help control with the frizz and the softness. Um, actually, I used it up now because, like I said, my hair is just up in a ponytail, and I just spritz water or wash it or whatever, and I put that in there. I have used it all up. Will I repurchase it again? Um, if I feel like repurchasing it um, when my hair is curly, it's okay. But when it's like this, it's great. So for me, it's okay. Next thing I have here is the Allocate Naturals Lemongrass Leave-In Conditioner and Ladies. Look like this. Men, women, kids, all. This is some good stuff here. They actually now have it in Target. I used to order it online, but I can pick it up in Target, which is really, really great. Um, so being with that said, I will repurchase this again. That I well, I love this stuff. Next thing I used up here is some cotton rounds. And these are just a little off-brand, generic kind from Walmart. Um, I think they're like a dollar and some change. Will I repurchase them again? Yes, because that's what I use when I use my toner on my face. And I use toner every day. So, just some regular cotton rounds. Yes. The next thing I have here, let's dig it out, is... The Beauty Blender Solid. I love to clean my um, Beauty Blender with this as opposed to the liquid. I did have a little bottle of the liquid. Look, you got all that trash over there. Don't come looking in this trash over here. Yeah. Will I repurchase this again? Yes. Um, it does get your brushes pretty clean. And I have used it all up, as you guys can see. And I'm already working on one that I have already purchased. So, although the only thing about this is that you can run out of it pretty fast. That's the only thing that I have, problem that I have with this. But other than that, it works great, great far as cleaning your beauty blender as well as your makeup brushes. I use it for both. So, yes, I will. So the next thing here I have here is the Origins High Potency Night Emits. That's what it says, y'all. Uh, there you go. Um, it's just a night cream. It worked really good. I like this um, night cream. Um, I found that it moisturized my face very well. Um, I know. The way, let me tell y'all this. The way I can tell if a moisturizer is working good for me is by my neck. Um, you know how you get that little crackiness in your neck? So I will put that on there and if, you know, when I wake up in the morning and if I see it smooth, then I know that it works really good. 
so I like this I enjoyed that will I repurchase it yes again I will I love the origins line can't beat that the next thing I have here is oh Maybelline's uh, Falsies mascara I love this mascara um, you can get it at any drugstore worked really really good for me but it started to dry out um, I had it for a long, long time so I had to get rid of it it probably still have a little bit more product in it but when it starts to flake I throw it out I will repurchase again love Maybelline's Falsy mascara the next mascara I have here is by Lorac I had this for a long time and it's the Lorac Pro love this mascara it has a whoop, a big chunky one as you guys can see there I will repurchase this mascara I love it I have a, quite a few mascaras that I love so I go in between them all switch out back and forth however the next thing I have here and it's surprisingly my first makeup well no it's not but far as on my makeup videos it is my makeup forever HD high definition I used it all up I can't believe I used it all up but I did <laughs> Wow I know it looked like it's still full but that's just the bottle but it's all gone you guys um, I love this foundation I purchased the new one that they have out and I'm loving it um, I also have in a stick and I'm loving that one I do not have it on my skin today but um, I do love them I love to change out between them all so I use that up so that's going The next makeup item I have here is my NARS Creamy Concealer in Biscuit. Excuse me, you guys. In medium dark. I love this. It's all gone. It done dried up, y'all. I try to get every last bit out of there. <laughs> love this. Love this. Love this. I already have another one in there. So, yes. Okay, I have another hair product down here. It's the Olive Oil. Miracle anti breakage maximum strengthening growth oil by African Pride. This is some good stuff. I do not like to use this because it's a little bit thick um, when I have my hair straightened. Absolutely not. But when it's in its natural state, yes, to um, moisturize my hair. Love this stuff. Will I repurchase it? Um, for $2.99, yeah. But I switch out so it's not a big deal it's like like the other thing it's not like I will go into the store I gotta have this particular one no because there's a lot on the market that's just like this and that works great so it was good though it was good so hey yeah what can you say the next thing I have here is my Marad post acne spot lightning gel this crap here I'm not gonna say crap this stuff here uh no baby no 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 don't put that in your mouth. <sighs> this worked good in the beginning. Um, but I think I might have. Because I stopped using it. So, and then it looked like it got some kind of stuff in it. So, it didn't start to work for me at all in the beginning. Um, I really can't say because I was trying it out then I started using something else so but this stuff was really expensive so being that will I try it out again stop where you put that in your mouth um will I buy it again no because it was a little bit too much money and I couldn't really tell if it did or not and that's probably my fault but other than that no because it was just too too pricey um, the next thing I used up here is for my little one. Um, I got some empties for her in here. And this is the Ivy Pro Friend, the generic brand by Walgreens. Uh, when she was sick, sick, I got two in a pack for the price that I would pay for like the regular um, Motrin. So I picked it up and surprisingly it worked the same. Stop. <laughs> I'm trying to fight with her. So will I repurchase it? Yes, if I can get that great deal where I got two in a pack again. Absolutely. So, yes. Work great. Next thing we have here is our baby magic hair and body wash. Um, I love this scent. And this is a soft powder scent. Yeah, she loves to hold this. 
Uh, will I repurchase this again? Yeah, because I love the scent. Um, I love Baby Magic as far as um, the body wash and washing my little one. Absolutely, I will repurchase that again. And the last two things that I have here is by Curls. Well, another two things by Curls. And this is the baby line, you guys. This one is in the Itsy Bitsy Moisturizer. And then this one is the Ring Around the Curls Leave-In. Love this stuff. I put this on my daughter's hair every single day I do her hair. Yes, yes, yes. I also use the uh, shampoo and conditioner. Um, I love the whole baby's line in general. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Will I repurchase this again? Yes, I have already repurchased again. And we are already working on it as far as her hair um, currently now. I do want to try the... Um, brand by curls for the next ages up um i do want to see how that works yeah you do too all right <laughs> so but these are great products um i was using it ever since she was little i would use the baby magic and i learned that that was drying her hair out and i switched to this and her hair is just soft i mean it's already naturally soft but it helps keep it manageable um if you have a little one I would suggest trying these. These, I just can't say enough about them. They just work really, really good. So, yeah. Enough on rambling. Oh, this is going to be a long video, you guys. So, I'm sorry. Truly, truly, truly sorry about that. But once again, thanks again for stopping by, clicking that button, watching my empties video. Um, come back for the next one. See you then. Bye.